Hello, this is Patricia Agner from the Rutland City Public Schools. I'm going to show you how to use an app called Snapverter from the Google Chrome Web Store, and we're going to take it and make PDFs listenable for our students in Google Drive. Let's go ahead and get started. To find Snapverter, first I have to go to the Google Chrome Store and search for the term Snapverter and Snapverter will show up for me. I'm going to add it to Chrome and I've added the app and here it is appearing under my Chrome apps. I'm going to click on it and it's going to give me a chance to create some folders. I'm going to go to settings to create folders. These are the folders used by the converter. I'm going to create some folders. To show you the folders created by Snapverter, I've gone to my Google Drive. And here is the folder called Snapverter. I'm going to open it up, and inside are four folders. Drop here to convert, failed, in progress, and finished. I'm going to show you now how to take a document that I've scanned and sent to myself via email and actually take it through the process. I've gone back to my Gmail, and I see I have scans from the photocopier. I'm going to open them up and I'm going to take this scan and save it to my drive. It's added it to my drive and here I can go and organize it. From my mail I can go over to my drive. I can see recent documents that I brought over and I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to move it. In my drive I'm going to look for Snapverter. And I'm going to drop it in there in the drop here to convert folder and move it there. And it will begin to convert it. I can go back to my Snapverter app and monitor the conversion. Now, if you're familiar with Snapverter, you know that you need to move your document to the processing box. I could do that right from my mail. I can click on Organize in Drive. I can open up my drive by going to Move this item. And in my drive, I can find the Snapverter box. And here it is. And I can drop it in there to convert. So that would be another way to work with my document. If it seems like it's taking a long time for your document to be converted, you can retry your conversion by clicking on retry and it will tell you that files are being processed one found. I can see that my document yaddo.history.pdf is now completed and it gives me a date and a time and I've shared it with no one at this point. I can click on it here to open it up and begin working with it or I can go to the finished folder in Snapverter. Either method will work. I'm going to open it up and I'm going to open it up with Read and Write for Google. I'm going to highlight some text. I will press Speak and it will begin to read the text to me. The property on which Yaddo stands originally housed a farm, grist mill, and tavern operated by Jacobus Farheit a Revolutionary War veteran who fought at the Battle of Saratoga. The last thing you want to do is share this document with a student. I'm going to right click on it, select share, and type someone's name that I want to share it with. So off it goes, now my document is shared with one person. I showed you how to use Snapverter with a scanner copier in the district. You can also use Snapverter with an iPad or with a phone and simply snap a picture of a document and then save it to your Snapverter folder in Google Drive. It's that easy. You can then share that converted document from Google Drive so that students can hear text read aloud with highlighting, see words and passages explained, and do much more with a tool like Read and Write for Google.